First at noon, a man and a woman are dead after their dirt bike crashed into a car at the intersection of Broad and Wheeler Streets in Cranston last night. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kate Walsh. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie is back at the scene this noontime with the latest details from police and people who visited the area today. Alex. Well, police have not formally identified the victims yet, but a family member who was related to who was related to one of the men on this dirt bike said that he was an awesome kid that loved his cousins and that he will be missed. It's just a tragic night in the city when you anytime you lose somebody like this. This dirt bike was left mangled in the middle of Broad and Wheeler Streets in Cranston Wednesday night after police say the bike and this red SUV crashed. Both a man and a woman on the bike died from their injuries. Thursday morning, flowers were left nearby and loved ones of those who died stopped by to pray and reflect on what happened. The red vehicle was traveling uh, northbound and the motorcycle was traveling southbound. The motorcycle is un unregistered. People who witnessed the aftermath told me the people riding the bike were not wearing helmets. We already know that the bikes were unregistered. We want to know um, how we can fix this so it never happens again, how we can create a safe environment, how we can create an allocated zone, how we can come together as a community and say, look, these lives are important. Now, police say the driver of the car was not injured in this crash. No one has been identified yet, and the cause is also still under investigation. We have calls out to police for more information. For now, reporting live in Cranston, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.